so much to learn about. It'll make you want to shout, Blippi! Today we're at Odyssey in Scottsdale, Arizona. This is gonna be awesome. I think today you and I should learn about some animals. Whoa, look at this place. Whoa, those are kind of like raindrops. Hello. Okay, let's go over here. It's gonna be so much fun! Oh, did you see that? I just used two fingers on the back of the head and the back of this Russian sturgeon. Oh, it looks like he liked it. Whoa, it feels so cool. It's hard but it also has kind of a layer of a slippery sludge on it. <laughs> it helps keep all the parasites away. Oh, here's another one. That is awesome! <laughs> I just touched the stingray nice and gently with my two fingers on its back. Whoa, okay, let's, uh, let's touch another one. Oh, here's one right over here. Oh, oh hey. Whoa, oh, that's silly. Ooh, come over here. Whoa, there's so many of them. Whoa. Look at that one, it's just resting on the ground. That's a different kind. Huh. Oh, here comes one. Whoa! Hey, I'll describe what it feels like. It kind of feels, oh, here's one more. Whoa! Yeah, I really know what it feels like now. It feels like a wet gummy bear. <laughs> oh, so slippery and soft at the same time, but firm as well. Wow, <laughs> this is fun. Whoa! Oh, hey! Hey, Blippi, what are you doing? Oh, just sitting here looking at my favorite fish, the paddlefish. Ooh, paddlefish? That's pretty cool. It is. Well, see you later. Hope oh, see you later, Blippi. This is pretty cool being behind the scenes of the aquarium. Hello. <laughs> this is awesome. Whoa. Uh, hey. So many cool workers here. Whoa. Look at this. We're on top of an aquarium. Whoa. Look at all that water and those fish down there. Whoa. Okay. Follow me. Whoa. Look at this room. Whoa, there's so much scuba gear in here. Tanks, wetsuits. Whoa. Okay, we need to take this fish to the sharks. I bet they're really hungry. Come on. Whoa. Wow. Okay. Whoa, look at this. Whoever drew that is a good artist. It shows the different parts of a shark. Yeah, like the gills. Oh. <laughs> Whoa, look! All right, we did it! Here you go. Hi, thank you. Yeah. You're welcome. What's your name? My name's Danny. Oh, this is Danny, and what are you doing here? So, we're here with Cassie, and she's actually feeding our big sharks right now. Oh, look, I see a fish down there. Look! Whoa, so what, why is she holding a fish on a pole? So that's how we get the food down to our sharks. If they're all pretty low in the water column, she needs to be able to have a really long tool to get the food down to their mouth. 
Okay. So they hold the pole, which has a fish on the end, and then the sharks come up and have some supper. <laughs> Ooh, this looks like fun. Whoa. Those fish look big. How big is that fish that she's feeding the sharks? It's about this big. It's called a blue fish because that has a kind of blue tint to it. Okay. That's a blue fish. That's about this big. So what kind of fish did I bring up? So you brought up some herring, which is a big fish in here. Okay. And then some caitlin, which is a little fish in here. Okay. Huh. Interesting. Oh. Hey, well, this is pretty cool seeing someone else do it, but hey, can I feed some sharks? Yeah, absolutely. Okay. okay. Just make sure you have your gloves on because the fish can be kind of stinky. <laughs> okay, all right. Let's put the gloves on so then my hands don't smell like fish for weeks. <laughs> okay, all right. I got my gloves on. Uh, oh, there we go. One glove, two gloves. All right. So now what do I do? So, Bucket that you brought up for our kitchen, and we'll head over here. Okay. All right. Okay. All right. We'll head over to our feeding platform. Okay. As soon as you walk up, the fish will be all ready for us. Okay. Whoa. Look. I'm on the platform. Whoa, look. There's no barriers between me and the fish. Okay. I'm just going to jump in. Just kidding. All right, here we go. Can I throw one at a time? Yeah, whatever you want. Either one at a time or all of it at once. All right, enjoy this. Whoa, look at them go. They're really enjoying this food. Whoa, look at all of them. They're swarming to the top because they know that I'm throwing all this yummy food to them. Alright, whee! Whee! Whoa! Here you go, fish. Is it that tasty? <laughs> is that tasty, fish? Or is that tasty? <laughs> okay, just a little left. Here we go. Whoa! That was so much fun! <laughs> Good job! Whoa! Ooh, she's feeding a turtle! Come on! Whoa! So many cool things up here! Whoa! Okay, let's go over here! Whoa! <laughs> Whoa! Okay, what are you doing? I am feeding Greta, our green sea turtle. Ooh, she's feeding Greta? That's a nice name. And this is Greta. Do you see Greta? Hey, Greta. Hey. Ooh, what does Greta like to eat? Greta loves lettuce, but she also enjoys cucumbers, bell peppers, and even sometimes carrots. Ooh, lettuce, bell peppers, Cucumbers and carrots? Sounds like Greta's really healthy. <laughs> Can I try feeding Greta? Yeah. Okay. All right. How do I do it? Just a little bit? Yeah, just a little bit. The whole leaf, you just pop it in front of her. Right. There you go, Greta. Whoa. Hey, what are you doing? It's trying to. Should I throw another one? Oh, sure. There we go. Sometimes you get them from Okay. All right. Ooh, Greta's hungry. Here you go, Greta. Yum. Here you go. Oh, Greta is really big. Do you know how much Greta weighs? She is a little bit over a hundred pounds. Oh wow, a hundred pounds. Wow. Oh, here you go. <laughs> okay, let's do a big piece. Let's watch Greta eat a whole piece. Here you go. Oh, it's right there. Yeah. Whoa. Hey. Uh -oh. Whoa. That's a big piece of lettuce. Hello. Hey. Hello. Oh, come on. Since we just 
touch some animals. I think we should use this restroom and wash our hands. Let's go. Okay, welcome to the bathroom. Whoa, look. Whoa, look. This restroom is underwater. And this restroom actually won the best restroom in America. Whoa, you can wash your hands right here. And look at shark. Sharks and fish. Whoa, this is awesome. <laughs> Pretty cool. All right, I wash my hands. Now I'll go dry them. You enjoy the view. down the escalator to the deep ocean. <laughs> Come on. Whoa, look. Now it's like we're underwater. Look this way. Oh, that's awesome. I present to you the Deep Ocean Exhibit. Hello. Hey. So this is a sea lion. Oh, there's another one over here. Oh, it's so big. <laughs> so cool. Oh, look, look, look. Oh, hello. <laughs> Whoa. And there's actually a seal in here as well. Let's go try and find it. Let's see. Oh, here it is. Hello. See that right here? This is a seal. Hi. So there's three sea lions in here and one seal. And the easiest way to tell the difference is this. I'll show you. So if you're a sea lion, you use your front flippers to basically walk like this. <laughs> but seals don't do that. Seals, oh, hello. Oh, you're curious, huh? <laughs> so curious. Whoa, so that's a sea lion. So it walks with its flippers. Hello, 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 hello. They're actually really smart animals. See how it's following me? I'll try and change directions. Whoa! <laughs> okay, and seals, they don't walk like that, you know? This is a sea lion. Sea lion. And a seal, they don't have that much power right here, and it's kind of short and stubby. So this is what they do. kind of waddle. <laughs> oh, that's silly. Wow, what magnificent creatures. Check them out a little bit more. Whoa, penguins? Yeah, we're behind the scenes at the aquarium and we're gonna meet some penguins, come on. Okay, let's walk nice and slow and we'll be very quiet as well. Ooh. Hey, who are you? Hutch. Ooh, this is Hutch. Hey, what do you do here? I work with the penguins and reptiles. Ooh, the penguins and the reptiles. Oh, do you see the penguins back there? Oh, hello. 
Are these your only two penguins here? Oh no, we have more friends that are coming. Would you like to grab a toy? We're actually going to play with them. Sure. Okay, let's grab a toy and let's see some more penguins. Look over there. They also can see colors really well and have rods and cones in their eyes just like we do. Okay. They're kind of, although they're birds, they're kind of acting like kitty cats, huh? Just a little bit. They do like to play with a lot of different types of toys. And just like kitty cats, they tell us when they want to be touched. Okay. Huh. Interesting. It's pretty cool. Hey, get a closer look. Oh, bye bye <laughs> Penguins are so silly. So where are these penguins from? These penguins are from South Africa. And okay. we have 32 of them here at the aquarium. Wow, 32 penguins here. And these are from South Africa? Yes. Not Antarctica? Not Antarctica. There are actually one of several species of penguins that prefer the warm climate. Oh, okay. That's pretty cool. Interesting. Warm climate and penguins. I guess you learn something every day. <laughs> hey, let's take a seat right over here. And then Hutch is gonna bring a penguin over. <laughs> I'm so excited. I get to touch a penguin. Ooh, hello. <laughs> hey, so I'm gonna touch the penguin with two fingers gently on its back. Hey, are you ready? felt so soft. Did you know penguins have 70 feathers per square inch? Yeah, they're really small and really dense. Can I touch the gam touch? Yes, you can. Okay. Does that feel good? You like that? She's showing off for you. What does that mean when she shakes her head? So that means she's really happy, uh, and you might be her new boyfriend. Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> I hope she doesn't want a kiss. <laughs> oh, hello! This is a little blue penguin. It's pretty small. Whoa! And this board has the sizes of different penguins. Oh, like the penguin I met today, an African penguin. Whoa, and they just keep getting bigger. Whoa, whoa, look how big they're getting. Whoa, look how big this penguin is. Whoa, four feet tall, 1.3 meters high. Jeez, look how big it is. Oh, whoa, that's a really big penguin. a toucan. <laughs> Do you see its beak? <laughs> kind of looks like the shape of a banana. A really colorful banana. <laughs> There's another bird over here. Come on. Whoa. Hello. <laughs> a colorful parrot. Hey. How are you? <laughs> Whoa. Looks like it's yellow, blue, and on its head, is green. <laughs> hey! Hey, there's another animal right over here I want to show you. Come on! Whoa, look! Look at this animal! It's moving really slow. <laughs> Do you know what animal this is? Yeah, this is a sloth. Let's act like a sloth together.
Hello! How are you? Ah! 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 <laughs> That's funny. All right, hello. These are otters, and they're so cute. Look at them go underwater. Whoa. I bet they can hold their breath for a really long time. Whoa. They're so fast. Whoa. <laughs> they kind of look like water cats, <laughs> but they're not kitty cats. <laughs> Whoa. Hi. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> oh, another one. <laughs> cool! Whoa! That was so much fun learning about all these creatures at Odyssey in Scottsdale, Arizona with you. Well, this is the end of this video, but if you want to watch more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? Ready? B-L-I-P-P-I. -P -P -I. Blippi, good job. All right, see you soon. <laughs>It's me, Blippi, and today we're here at the Southern California Railway Museum in Paris, California, <laughs> and we get to learn all about the world of trains, locomotives, streetcars, and trolleys. <laughs> yeah! Choo choo! Look at what it is! It's a streetcar! Oh, it's so cool! <laughs> oh, hi, John. It's nice to meet you. I'm Blippi. <laughs> nice to meet you, Blippi. I'm so excited to ride the streetcar. Can I find a seat? Absolutely. Okay. <laughs> Wait, do I need a ticket, though? Well, yeah, you're gonna need a ticket, Blippi, but I've got one right here for you. Ah, uh, thanks so much! Oh, and John gave me a ticket it's the color orange. <laughs> Come on, let's find a seat. Whoa. And look, these seats can go both ways. I can sit this way, <laughs> or I can sit whoa, the other way. <laughs> whoa. <laughs> mm, I think I'll sit facing this way. <laughs> I think we're all ready to ride the streetcar. <laughs> we can go! Woo! <laughs> Whoa! It's so loud! <laughs> Whoa! That was a really loud bell from this big steam train. <laughs> well, I am so excited because we're here with John, the motorman, and he knows all about trains and steam trains and trolleys and streetcars. <laughs> oh, John, where are we? We're in Car House 4 at the Southern California Railway Museum. Whoa, Car House 4. Yeah, that's where they keep all those trains and locomotives. And we get to look at them all. Let's go explore. <laughs> Come on. Whoa, look at how big this place is. <laughs> Whoa, there are so many train cars here and they're all different colors. Blue <laughs> and red, the color yellow. Oh, <laughs> and I bet you know the color of this train car. It's the color green. <laughs> Whoa, and do you see what it says on this train? Yeah, United States Mail. Hmm, hey, John. Did this train deliver mail? Oh yeah, before there was airplanes, there was mail trains. Whoa, <laughs> whoa, did you hear that? Yeah, a long time ago, they used to use train cars like this green train 
to deliver the mail. <laughs> That's so cool. But I bet we can find some other trains that are really cool too. Come on. They're so big. <laughs> I feel really small, like a tiny blippy. Because these trains, they're giant. <laughs> Whoa. And they have really big wheels. Whoa. Look at how big the wheels are. They're almost as big as me. Woo. <laughs> and these trains have a really big shocks. Yeah, those are the springs right here. <laughs> Just like on a monster truck. <laughs> They're so cool. <laughs> Whoa. Let's see what else we can find. <laughs> Whoa. Come on, look at this train right here. Hmm. Uh, John, this brown train car looks a little bit different. What's that big boxy thing on the top? Well, that's called a tower car. That's so that the electricians can safely work on the overhead wire without getting shocked. Whoa, tower car? <laughs> that's so cool. Yeah, trains, they have a cable that gives electricity and helps the train run. And this train right here, <laughs> yeah, this one, it is a really good train where people could work safely to repair it. <laughs> Whoa, it is so cool. It looks really old. Ooh, <laughs> so old. <laughs> oh, hm. let's keep exploring trains. Whoa, come over here. <laughs> Whoa, this train looks beautiful. Yeah, it has big white wheels and is a beautiful color red. Hmm. John, did anyone important ride in this train? Well, this train used to belong to the president of the Pacific Electric Railway. He took that on inspection tours. Whoa, the president of the train company? <laughs> I want to ride in this one. <laughs> but it looks like we need to put our luggage in one of the freight trains. Whoa. <laughs> I have a lot of luggage. Ooh. We gotta put it on the train because there's a different train car for your luggage. Yeah, you don't bring it on the train that you sit on. You put it over here. Whoa, <laughs> this is a really tall train. Whoa. Okay, whoa. <laughs> Dusty, ooh. <laughs> yeah, this freight train car would carry all of your luggage. <laughs> It looks like we learned about all kinds of trolleys and trains. <laughs> I, I think we should probably head back though. Hello. <laughs> Whoa, I'm having so much fun learning all about trains and trolleys. <laughs> Thanks so much for helping us out today, John. Hey, it's my pleasure, Blippi. <laughs> and just as a little memento, I'm gonna give you one of my pins. Whoa. No way! A real life train pin! <laughs> Thank you so much, hey, John. It's my pleasure, Blippi. Bye bye! Nice to meet you. <laughs> oh, this is so cool! I'm gonna pin it on my suspenders. No way! It's a real life locomotive! And it's so big! <laughs> Whoa! I have an idea. Maybe this can be the locomotive that we drive. <laughs> oh, and look, there's a conductor. Hello. Hi, Blippi. Hey, can we drive the Santa Fe 108? Of course you can, come on aboard. Okay. Oh, uh, uh, go in through the nose. Oh, okay. Let's go in through the nose. <laughs> so silly. Come Over on. here, Blippi. Oh, thanks. Welcome aboard. Whoa. We're going in the train through the nose. <laughs> Come on, see you inside. Whoa. Whoa, we're inside the locomotive. <laughs> it's so cool here. Oh, hello, what are your names? Hi, my name's Carson. And my name's Bryce. Oh, it's nice to meet you. And what do you do on the train? Uh, we are engineers. Oh, whoa, that is so cool. And the front of the locomotive is so cool. Uh, do you know the name of the room we're in? Yeah, this is the cab of the locomotive where all the controls are located. <laughs> Whoa! Whoa, 
and it looks like there are a lot of controls. <laughs> There's controls there and over here. <laughs> Whoa, it looks like a really big electrical panel. <laughs> Ooh, can I open this up? Sure you can. Oh, um, what's inside here? Uh, more electrical switches, some of the main circuit breakers and the main circuit breaker for the locomotive. Oh, there are all kinds of buttons and switches that control different parts of the train right here. Yeah, there's a switch for the lights, a switch for the radio, <laughs> and even a switch for a fuel pump. Oh, this looks really important. <laughs> oh, and hmm, we'll close this. And uh, what's behind this door? That's the engine bay. Oh, can we go and see the engine? Of course. <gasps> I'm so excited to go behind that door to see the engine, because trains go really fast. Maybe it's a really big engine. <laughs> Let's see. Come on in. Okay, come on. <laughs> Ooh, I'll see you in the engine room. <laughs> this down here is the 20 cylinder engine that provides 3,600 horsepower. Whoa, this it's is, so big. <laughs> this is the water that keeps it cool. Whoa, and what's this right here? This is the air compressor that generates air pressure for the brakes and the horn and the bell. Whoa, that is so cool. The engine in this engine room is so big, it takes up a room. <laughs> Whoa, and has 20 cylinders. Yeah, did you hear that? Maybe a car will only have four cylinders and cars go pretty fast. So if a train has 20 cylinders, oh, that's super fast. <laughs> Whoa. This is also really cool, this air compressor. Is there a brake back here as well? Yes, there's a handbrake back here that keeps us from moving when we don't have air pressure. Ooh, whoa, right here? Yes. Whoa, look at this, this wheel is a brake. Hmm, and do I turn it to start the train? This way. Okay, whoa, <laughs> we're putting on the brake. Whoa, <laughs> this is so cool, <laughs> whoa. Trains are really cool and really fast. Hey, why don't we see how fast this train can go and drive it ourselves? <laughs> I think we should head back to the cab and take it for a ride. <laughs> Come on. Oh, look at this. It's the driver's seat in the cab. <laughs> There's so many different levers and gauges <laughs> to start the train. Whoa. So Carson, how do you start the train? Well, you start the train by turning on a lot of the circuit breakers in the circuit panel. Okay. And you actually have to go back into the engine bay. Oh, and there's okay. a toggle there that actually starts everything in there. Cool. Uh, we'll take care of that a little bit later. Okay. Whoa, and what is this right here? That right there is the throttle that makes the train go fast or slow. <laughs> Whoa, can I pull on it? Uh, not right now, it's not set up to go anywhere yet. Okay, cool. <laughs> but this is the throttle, hmm, then I bet that means this is the brake. That's correct. <laughs> if you're going too fast in the train, you can just stop it with the brake. <laughs> Whoa, and if you need to make the train go backwards, is there a way to do that? There is, if you pull out that little knob right there, Stick it in this slot here. Yeah, that's Whoa. the reverser. That's kind of like the key for the locomotive. Whoa, look, it's a reverser. Yeah, it's a key. And you just put the key right in this hole. And then you can make the train go forward. Whoa, <laughs> or backwards. <laughs> oh, that's pretty cool. Whoa, and can I press this button or pull this? You can pull that one. Whoa. This right here says bell. <laughs> I wonder what happens when I pull it. Whoa, did you hear that? <laughs> that was so cool. That is. And what was the sound of the air? Well, that was the air that runs the bell. A lot of the locomotive is run on air power. That's why it has such a large compressor for running so much of the equipment. Whoa, this locomotive's amazing. It uses diesel fuel electricity and air power. Whoa! <laughs> and I bet I know what this is. I should do. Okay. Hmm. What do you think will happen when I pull this lever? <laughs> I'll give you a hint. It's gonna be really loud. 
<laughs> you think I should pull it? Okay, let's pull the horn! <laughs> Whoa, that horn is so loud. Hmm. Well, why is there a bell and a horn? What is the horn used for? Well, the horn is used to communicate with other people, other trains, what that train you're on is going to be doing. Oh, so what does one horn mean? It means I'm stopped. <laughs> I'm stopped. Hmm. What about two? It means I'm going to go forward. Okay. <laughs> Time to go forward. And what about three horns? I'm backing up. <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> Trains are pretty amazing. And horns are so useful to communicate with other people. <laughs> well, I think we're about ready to start the train. I'm so excited. <laughs> I'm so excited to operate the locomotive. We've learned so many things about the engine and all the different switches. <laughs> it's gonna be so much fun when we turn it on. Hmm. Uh, just one question. Uh, Carson? Yeah? How do we turn on the locomotive? Well, we start here with the main circuit breaker panel. Oh, main circuit's already on because we had the lights on back there. Otherwise, we switch everything on. <laughs> Every single one. <laughs> okay. Uh, uh, uh. There's two over here. If you want to take a seat, you can flip those two on. Okay. I'll sit in this chair that controls the train. <laughs> and I'll head the one? engine run switch. The engine run. And the control and fuel pump. Control and fuel pump switch. There you go. And now I'm going to head into the back and fire it up. Okay. I'll see you soon. <laughs> oh, I am so excited to ride and operate a locomotive. Hmm. Just one question though. Uh, I don't know what a locomotive is. <laughs> uh, Bryce, what's a locomotive? What's the machine that's at the very front of the train that pulls all the cars behind it? Oh, so a locomotive has the engine. Yeah, trains, they don't have engine. Train cars, they're just pulled. So if you have a lot of train cars and a locomotive, you have a train. But if there are no train cars, it's called a locomotive. <laughs> I think we're all ready to start a locomotive. <laughs> One more thing, Blippi. Oh. It gets very loud in here when we start up the engine. So you gotta put earplugs in. Okay, let's put in our earplugs. It's gonna be so loud. <laughs> We're gonna take that reverser key. Yep, go ahead and stick that in its slot again. Reverse. Yep. All right. Go ahead. Actually, there's a few other steps for me. Okay. Sorry. A few other lights. Put it in run so it'll actually go somewhere. Those two switches you flipped earlier, that middle one, Genfield, go ahead and flip that up. Okay. Now the locomotive will send power to the wheels. So now. Put the reverser to forward. Okay, here we go. There you go. The uh, handle above the throttle, bump that forward once. Okay. There we go, that'll actually make us go instead of use the engine as the brakes. Okay. So turn on the bell. Pull on the whistle twice. <laughs> Pull the throttle one notch. And release the brakes. Whoa! I think we're gonna start moving! And away we go! Whoa! <laughs> Look at us go! We're operating a train in real life! Woo! <laughs> All right, blow the whistle in a pattern. Long, 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 short, long. Like we're going 10 miles an hour! But 
we can go up to 90 miles an hour. That's really fast! So sometimes you need to go faster? You can. Okay. Yeah. You want to go faster, you can pull the throttle back another notch or okay. two. Okay. <laughs> it looks like we're going faster. <laughs> hey, do you think I should pull the throttle another notch to go even faster? <laughs> okay, let's try it. <laughs> all right, Blippi, go ahead and put the throttle all the way forward. Yep, all the way to there. And now we're just going to coast for a while. much fun operating a locomotive. <laughs> well, this is the end of this video, but if you want to watch more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Hey, will you spell my name with me? Okay, here we go. B-L-I-P-P-I. -P -P -I. Blippi, good job. Well, I'll see you real soon. Bye-bye.